Johnny Wachter, known for his role as Brando Corbin on General Hospital, passed away at the age of 37. His on-screen wife, Sophia Matson, expressed her deep sorrow and admiration for her late co-star in a heartfelt social media tribute. Matson shared a series of photos from the ABC soap opera on Instagram, accompanied by a touching caption. My heart is so utterly broken. Johnny was the absolute best, she wrote. So genuine. So caring. Incredibly hardworking and humble. With a huge heart that spread so much kindness and joy. He always made sure everyone around him felt seen, heard and loved. I admire the man he was so much and I'm a better person for having known him. She continued, we shared so many special moments, both on and off screen, and I will forever cherish them deeply in my heart. You will be so incredibly missed, Johnny. I'm sure you're already busy taking care of everyone up there. Wachter portrayed Brando Corbin on General Hospital from 2020 to 2022. His character was introduced as the long-lost son of Gladys Corbin, played by Bonnie Burrow. Brando's storyline captivated fans as he navigated his return to Port Charles, his relationship with his mother, and his marriage to Sasha, played by Matson. Brando's tragic death came after he was stabbed by a mysterious assailant, known as the Hook. Wachter's sudden passing has left a significant void in the hearts of his co-stars and fans alike. Matson's tribute reflects the deep bond and mutual respect they shared, both on and off the set. Her words serve as a testament to Wachter's character, both as an actor and as a person, highlighting the impact he had on those who knew him. In remembering Johnny Wachter, Matson's tribute encapsulates the essence of a beloved actor whose legacy will continue to resonate within the general hospital community and beyond. His portrayal of Brando Corbin, marked by authenticity and emotional depth, will be cherished by fans and colleagues who mourn his untimely death.